So we had the pressure switch fail on the Bobcat. And the hydraulic pressure switch, uh, the old one, I don't have over here, but this is what the old one looked like. And it goes just right here threads into this filter housing. Actually, there's a T in the filter housing. This one does the pressure. There's another one over here that does the uh, temperature. I'm guessing that's that one. Um, or that could be, I don't know, there's three, three sensors on this filter. I just know that this one's the pressure sensor, and this is the one that was bad. So I'm going to put some pipe joint compound on it. It was a 5 8 and then I think this was a half inch. Yeah, this was a half inch, and I held that part with 5 8 and just unthreaded it. There is a wire that plugs into it right there. This little three wire. So we're going to thread, put some pipe joint compound on here and thread that in. And there we go. Thread it in, and I just put it to where the uh, little clip for the wire was facing out so that it, when I need to undo it, it's easy to undo it. Quick and easy fix. This one was uh, had ruptured, in, ruptured internally or whatever and was leaking. Thanks for watching.